Hi, Els here, and today I'm going to introduce you to merchandising businesses. Up until now, we've been focusing on service businesses in order to learn recording the transactions, producing the financial statements. However, merchandising businesses, ones that buy and sell inventory, are just as common. Every time you walk into a Costco, a Walmart, Canadian Tire, you're walking into a merchandising business. The key to a merchandising business is inventory. They are both the buyers and the sellers of inventory. Those inventory transactions increase the complexity of the accounting system. In addition, merchandising companies don't prepare a single step income statement. Instead, they produce a multiple step income statement. It provides additional details necessary so that stakeholders can make informed decisions. In this series of videos, we'll be answering the following questions, and there's a lot of them. One, what are the differences between a service and a merchandising business? Two, what's the difference between a periodic and a perpetual inventory system? What are the benefits and drawbacks of each type of system? Three, how can a perpetual inventory system be used to record basic inventory transactions? Four, how do shipping terms and credit terms affect how we record the purchases and sale of inventory? And finally, last, what is the difference between a single step and a multiple step income statement? All right, we got a lot to cover. Let's get started.